in this problem it is given that the mark price of a painting by the shopkeeper is rupees r1 so mark price of the painting is r1 he gives three successive discounts of x percent each and thereby sells it at rupees 3362.8 rupees so selling price of the article is 3362.80 rupees find the approximate value of r1 so we have to find value of r1 if the reduction in the price due to the second discount is rupees 415 three discounts are given suppose these discounts are d1 d2 and d3 here value of d2 is given as 415 and the discount percentage is x percent on the basis of the given information if we take a traditional route like subtracting x percent from r1 and then finding value of the article or painting after first discount in case it is r2 and then again reducing the price by x percent in event of second discount and suppose that price is r3 here difference between r2 and r3 is given as 415 so it would be quite complex and would be a time consuming process so we should see what happens if three discount of a fixed percentage point is offered on some price let here price be rupees 100 and discount percent be 10 percent after first discount the price will be 90 which means the value of d1 will be 10 and when the second discount of the same 10 percent is given then the reduction in price will be of rupees 90 sorry 9 and the price after this will be 81 and when again a discount of 10 percent is offered the reduction in price that is third discount will be 8.1 percent and when we take average of these three figures it comes out as 27.1 by 3 this is slightly more than 9 and here 9 is the second discount and if we take another example like price 100 100 and discount 20% then here d1 will be 20 d2 will be 16 and d3 will be 12.8 again the average of these three figures will be 48.8 upon 3 this is again slightly more than 16 which is which is the second discount so here in order to find the approximate value of mark price what we need to do we need to add thrice of that would be the total discount of the middle discount which is 415 and thrice of 415 will be 1245 and as we have already observed the actual discount would be slightly more than 1245 so when we add 1245 to 3362.80 will get answer close to 4610 therefore option d is the correct answer here the trick was 
not to go by the normal method whereby reducing x percent as a first discount and then reducing x percent as a second discount and then finding the difference between the price obtained after second discount and the price after the first discount and then equating that to 415 rather we just needed to observe what the middle discount would be in comparison of the three discounts and on observation we found that the middle discount in case there were three discounts was approximately the average of the three discounts so just applying this concept we reached to the answer very quickly had we gone through the method of redu reducing x percent we would have taken at least five six minutes so that's all about this problem